Crazy Vocations with Kiki Young. I'm your host, Kiki Young. <laughs> with a Y-E-U-N-G. All right, today we're having a lot of fun with our two guests. Uh, you have seen him on uh, Amazon Prime Laugh uh, After Dark. Uh, you've also seen the other guy on Fox, I Can See Your Voice. Give yeah. it up for Danny Plum and Eric Estepan. Yeah. What up? What? What What's up, up what everybody? Up? What's up, Crazy Woke Asians? Crazy Woke Asians, we out here. Yeah, we out here. Yeah, here. flashback Mike. Props to Dante and Paul, the motherfucking tech. Flashback Mike. <laughs> Shout out. I was just saying how cool this studio is, how mm -hmm. cool this establishment is. Mm -hmm. Shout out to Dante Chang. For it's doing cozy, this. bro. Oh, yeah. It's, it's great. super cozy. Like, look at all that little... That Yoda is looking at us. So is that a stormtrooper First holding Yoda? First of all, Yoda? I'm going to correct you because I'm a nerd and I'm going to yeah, correct, correct you. That's me. Baby I don't know. Grogu. Okay, and whatever. And that's the Mandalorian. But I don't know why you're oh trying to shit, say Baby Yoda. I don't we know. all know his name they is Grogu. They all look like Yodas to me. I don't okay, know. Okay, yeah, well, it's, it's Grogu. <laughs> you okay? sound like my husband, like super geeking out on this shit, Star Wars. He has little They made a plastic statue of it. You really? should honor it and, oh and, and, and God, call Lord. the statue Sorry, the right thing. Sorry, people. Thing. Excuse me. You're a big Sorry. Marvel fan. I'm Eric? a big you nerd. Big I'm a super nerd. Super, super nerd. Who's your favorite superhero? <laughs> Spider-Man. Uh -huh, that's Jason uh, Rogers, man. too. Such a toddler answer. You got long nails. Yo, man, we're about to fight. Like Spider-Man. <laughs> My son loves Spider-Man, too. Why, why would you say toddler Spider-Man? Because toddlers like Spider-Man. Like 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 everybody loves Spider-Man because Spider-Man is a universal hero because basically anybody can be Spider-Man. Because yeah. anybody really? could get if bitten. If they get bitten... Yeah, anybody. They might die though. Anybody could get. And if you if you've seen Enter the Spider Verse, you can really see how whatever happens uh. in the universe, you could be the Spider Man, and it, oh, yeah? and you could end up being because there's a Spider Woman, there's an old Spider Man, there's a middle aged Spider Man, there's even a piglet Spider Man. I'm just being real. I feel like it's such a default superhero. Like, you, of course, default. you would say Spider Man. You know, like you should well, pick like. Okay, Loki okay, or something. Okay, like okay. Well, like, okay, okay. You want me to pick like my, who's my favorite? My favorite superhero got me into comics was Spider Man. Mm. Oh yeah. But my favorite comic book, like and favorite comic book story and favorite character in comic books, mm. it's Wolverine. Oh. Okay, that makes more sense. Wolverine yeah, and that's then probably badass. Wolverine, Deadpool, and then Spider Man as far as it goes in the comic book realm, I would go that would be my Wolverine, Deadpool, Spider Man. Okay. But Spider Man as far as like youthful, like my favorite Hero that got me into everything. For sure. Spider-Man. For sure. You got to go with Peter Parker. How about you, know. you, Danny? My favorite? Yeah. Ooh, I like uh, uh, superheroes. I, I watch a lot of anime, so <laughs> I'm going to go with uh, One Shang Punch Man. Shang does, too. Shang, Shang likes anime. One Punch Man? Yeah. One you Punch Man. Yeah, I know anime. What is you know that? About I know anime. You yeah. never seen it, Kiki? I don't know. You are crazy woke <laughs> Asians and you don't watch anime? You are. No, the I don't. <laughs> you better I watch start my watching son it or you better do his you better, homework. Better be put crazy I'm too busy Asians. doing shit like this <laughs> to watch any anime. You should be running it in the background. I don't have time to watch Have it running Netflix. in the background um, while you're while, I so watch that'd be Homeland, cool. Though. That'd be cool. That'd be a I only cool like to watch white people um yeah, terrorist shows. white people that's, shit. That's what they do like. That's the thing. I love it. Claire Days is so good. You know what? To be honest, ever since like the whole representation matters uh -huh. kind of thing, a couple uh -huh. of years ago started, uh -huh. like I have actively not watched shows that are too many white people. Too many white people. Uh, like, sometimes I do that. I really? watched the Friends reunion and I realized oh. how much I was like, wow, there oh. are there were a lot of white people in New York. <laughs> in the <laughs> 90s. Am I right? Though? Like that was yeah. a crazy show to think. Like in the middle of New York. The most oh, metropolitan it's all city. Oh, yeah. I see and your point. And uh -huh. then all of these white people just hung out together. Yeah, no black, no Mexican, no Asian. There wasn't yeah. even one Asian yeah. person or That's one. That's true. And it, That's it, interesting. It blew my mind when I actually huh. watched. Watch it again, huh? When you, when you watch uh. it again 20 years removed, you're well, like, Well, Sex wow. in the City did that for me. Like, I was growing up looking up to these ladies, and, I'm, and now I look back and I, I watch the. I still love it, but I'm like, where are the Asians or the... Black mm. ladies or the Mexican ladies. <laughs> I'm so mad yeah. about that show. I thought it was a porno. <laughs> <laughs> like, I legit. Like, uh, it was going to be on HBO. I was so like disappointed. Oh, like, you were hoping to see some titties. titties. There are titties. Yes, but it wasn't, yeah, but like, it wasn't like penetration oh, titties. Time. Then just watch porn. It was like porn I didn't know. I was like, when I was a kid, oh, damn. and I'm throwing on HBO late at night. Were you 10? 
I don't know how old I was. You were young. I was young. So you I had to go on Cinemax. That was the that yeah. was the that was the, the, Cinemax. Cinemax, I know. But if you wanted that stuff, yeah. that was where you went. You went well, Cinemax. I'd stay, I'd stay up late. They just grind. It's all fake. I know. Like it was like what 10 p.m. was when it started, and uh, my grandma would like you know go to bed. So I'd sneak out and be like, oh here we go. And then when it popped up, it wasn't even sex. It was like you know a bunch of girls. Like there was a lot of build up before the actual oh. boobies came out. Oh. Yeah, no, I was really disappointed. You just yeah, fast forward. I, I, I feel that was, John, that's that was during dial-up days for me. <laughs> <laughs> well, now that was the other thing about that time. Like there was no, there weren't like go-to porn channels that you could go to for that type of thing. You no. Oh yeah. Like it, in you, the nineties. Like no. they had even like the the TV channels. Uh -huh. Yep, yep, yep. Where you could like you could where go to the even porn if you didn't shop, have though. cable, you could? you could go to no, you could go to the yeah, but who wants porn a stack of fucking shit. videos? My husband has <laughs> he had a stack of. Does he of still have videos? I made him throw them all away. I'm like, fuck no. you, got a porn what? addiction, man. I'm like, shit, stop. No, no, no. Mm -mm 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 -mm. See, I could never, no, no, I could no. never commit like, to no, one, no. one porn video. No, I, he I has a bored. stack. Yeah, so you probably had one too, didn't no, you? No, I did not have. Sure, I you did didn't. not. No, no I did not. just like you geeking out. There's a stack of Star Trek. Uh, Why is it because I like Star Trek? I like porn. No, I just say you you get bored. You say you get bored with one porn. So I would think I would you would have a I would get bored with one videotape yeah, for sure. Yeah, so you would like have I a like stack, the plethora you? of porn that we sure. have now online. That's wonderful. Oh, it's great. It's wonderful. It's, it's like great. you don't even you uh -huh, don't even uh -huh. have to like Back I don't even it. leave my car. Uh -huh. Does your wife like that? Does do you watch it with her? Hell no, I don't watch porn Why? with my wife. What's wrong? Why not? I just uh, that's not that's something too much. I that's that's because you only want to fantasize that's about the, that's the girl and the no, TV, not your wife. No, that's me time. <laughs> oh shit, that's me time. It's me time. But I know couples that do that. It is literally the only me time I get. I used to do that with my husband when we were young. When we were like 20, 21, we were young. You we could watch. You watch porn with together. Husband? We weren't husband. We were just dating back then. Like uh, you know, is I that was a thing? twenty. Do you get it like was turned fun. on and stuff by that? Yeah, Have you ever watched porn with anybody you been with? I. Nah, I well I, maybe a, a few times, but it got awkward, you know. Yeah, it got awkward. Saying. Yeah, because like it's yeah, like because because like because you're too focused on the girl. Yeah, you know? look, look, <laughs> that's why. A, look, especially when I'm a, look, because I'm a dad and I have two kids. Oh, that's hard then. And it's hard for me to even just masturbate in general. Damn. So, so like I have you to hide in the closet. I, I have to find time. No, I Damn. I, five I used in the morning. to. I used to have to go in. I, I still do Check in the garage. Five. I go in the garage. Garage. Like I'll be like I'll be like <sighs> driving. I'll be like driving and then I like hear like a like a Meg Stallion song and oh be like shit. get all horny and be like damn. Meg Stallion makes song. you horny. Hell yeah, what? Meg Stallion That's makes easy. me horny. Sing it. Come sing it. Look, I don't want to sing Meg Let's Stallion. Let's sing sing one. We yeah, want to yeah, see yeah, him yeah. around. Come on. Meg, Meg Stallion. Come on. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, Look, uh, I'm what's just saying I don't I don't even have to I'm I don't even savage. really know. Uh, Classic, classy, classy, boozy, boozy, ratchet. ratchet. Oh <laughs> my god. Ooh, no, but erectic. look at, look at no, <laughs> no. No, but she's sexy. She's sexy. So I'm listening yeah, to Meg she's Stallion. She's bad. She's bad. She's, she's bad. bad. Yeah, she's she is bad. Uh, like I already thick. know that like yeah. I'm I'm 5'8 and like 160 pounds. I already know that I could never like Meg Stallion and I would never be a thing. That Why would not? never be. A I thing. dated a short guy. He no, was being me a but Meg Stallion would break me in half. So I wait, let me ask you a question, way. Eric. So back in the day, <laughs> like I know you get aroused from just music. So did you like not have magazines like back then? Yeah, I didn't have to. You just you could just nah. listen to a song. I could and be listen like, to Damn. "Oops, I Did It Again" <laughs> by Britney. <laughs> oh yeah. my goodness! Yo, I could watch. Oops, I and then been, did boom. it again. I'm especially singing for you, especially when I, I was single. With your heart. And I just play with it. Got lost in the game. Yo, I could watch. Ooh, baby, I didn't need play. Oops. Channel because I, think I'm in love. I had MTV. Focus. You know what I had? From above. You know how many times I, I whacked off the genie in the bottle? Christina Aguilera. Oh, I like that too. <laughs> dirty. She's so dirty. I, hey, she's playing at the Hollywood Bowl. That, is that is that bad to say? Did that uh, that I masturbated to Christina Aguilera? No. I mean, if you know, I was I a teenage I boy, canceled, I would masturbate you know. to her. She's hot. Yeah, I mean, she you was, know, especially back in the day. When you're poor, in a bottle, man. When you're poor, I, I used to masturbate to the uh, a good Kmart bra catalog. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You ever see one of those? Yeah. Yes, I, I, I have. My mom that was all my shit right there. That was, oh, damn. I was like, dang, this one's busted. So you're like, imagining. Girl, like when, you're, when you're poor and you don't have no money to go like buy no, magazines or anything? I couldn't buy mags. Um... I, my uncle lived with me and my grandma too, and he had like, like a stack of tapes. Oh wow! Your I didn't know that yet, though. I didn't know that yet. Be so before the tapes, I, and I found his secret stash. I had to, I go, you know, they, you know, we go to Kmart and stuff. We had these cat catalogs, and you could just watch and, and look at them and flip through and Bro, see. Bro, I know the catalogs of Kmart, and I know the catalogs of service merchandise, mm. and I know the catalogs of Victoria's Secret when they started coming. Bro, yeah. that was the best. It's amazing. The most, the most amazing thing as, as, as a <laughs> teenage boy. Oh, Victoria's. You guys got to understand like that Danny and I are coming from a time when you didn't have 
any like you didn't have a phone or yep. you didn't have internet to like stimulate you and go. I was born in eighty eight. I was wow, yeah. you're young. I was in born in seventy four. Wow, you're old. Seventy four. <laughs> <laughs> God damn. Oh. Yeah, I was born in nineteen seventy four. You're his big bro, man. Yeah. This was like so. This He's is newspaper time. This is newspaper. Newspaper time. Yeah, it's for real. Paper, newspaper, Sunday paper. TV. Yes, and like I love keep, the nineties. I keep telling my kids, I'm like, because they they're always like, Daddy, can we just watch? And I'm like, No, you can't just watch. Turn that shit off <laughs> because it's on all the time. You just have to press play. It's on demand. You can just do it whenever you want to watch it. It's Amazing. right there. Netflix or where Disney, t- Disney yeah. Plus DVR, right? is or that what whatever it is, is. D- DVR, yeah. DVR. But the DVD. streaming, the, oh. but the streaming services make it so you don't have to be at front of your yeah. f- fucking TV at yeah. s- seven o'clock in the morning to watch Saturday morning cartoons because that's the only time yes, you show cartoons. Yes, you can watch. Yes, you can now you can watch twenty four hours. You can which watch is, whenever you it want. It was just a so, double edged sword. So turn it off. Yeah. So turn it off. And let's do something else. That's how else. you do pre- parenting, you huh? Got to do you guys got, you guys, you yeah. got a girl. I have two, two girls. girls. Yeah, two boys. Yeah. I have one boy. Ooh, kids. Let's Ooh. talk about being a parent. Ooh. Ooh, yeah. Are you guys tired? You want to take a nap right now? Yeah. <laughs> Danny, should I tell the story of what happened just when I got Yeah, here? you oh, should. Okay, what so, happened? So I've been harping on my, my six-year-old mm. to pick up her stuff, mm. put put it away, put, mm. put stuff where it's supposed to go. Mm. Put your socks in the sock oh. drawer. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, put your toys in the right place. Like, uh, like yeah. put your, put, put your mm-hmm. stuff in the right place, right? Okay. So it, it's been. Mm. Like, like she, she scraped her knee and then left all the bandages all on the floor. Oh. Right? So she's getting careless. Uh-huh. And, like, she, she got a maid. She don't give a fuck. She, yeah, yeah like, you're her, her like, maid. Like, like, she don't give yep. a fuck. Right. Mm-hmm. And so today, now, yesterday, I went and bought Big ass seventy two ounce bottle of tequila for Father's Day. <laughs> well, I buy that. Happy Father's I Day to buy you, that bi- Eric. Weekly now, thank you, quarantine Damn. for my alcoholism. Yeah, yeah but turning anyway. into an alcoholic. Oh, now? The turning, no, turned already. Okay, so <laughs> anyhow, <laughs> that's like the quarantine. Dang. Like, <laughs> no, that's for real. Like, I probably drink tequila every day. Damn. But anyway, whatever. <laughs> we'll talk about Did that. Did you just yeah, drink some <laughs> earlier? No, no, no. You didn't bring this is some for meeting. us. No. Uh, what no. kind of person are no, you? No, I get marijuana through the day and then tequila oh, okay. to go to Did sleep. Did you bring Come a on. joint for us? <laughs> what kind of person are you? I should have brought a joint. You know, Anything? Knowing, from, knowing from what we know where we're at. I should have brought one. Yeah, well, man. Wait, how come? Wait, you you asked us to come to the podcast. How come you didn't bring me? No, yeah, you didn't have I'm no, bringing you no gifts for the, 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 the opportunity of talking right now. I should I should have brought you a joint. I'm Kiki. just I'm fucking sorry. with you. But no, tell me <laughs> what happened. I don't even really okay. Spoke. No, so so this afternoon, right before I got here, she ate a piece of cake mm. on a plate. Mm. Cake sounds good. Pushed it <gasps> onto the counter, <gasps> and Ooh. this shelf that was on the counter fell. Ooh. And bad girl, the brand new bottle of tequila fell. Oh shit! And shattered. Oh, did she get hurt? Did no, she, she didn't. Thank God she didn't thank get hurt. God she didn't which get hurt. was my first worry. Oh, I was yeah. like, oh my God, she like, just shit. got hit with a was tequila bottle Julio? and it shattered. Bloody, bloody bloody no, baby. it was just Cuervo. So oh, just Cuervo. Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was on sale. It was okay. It wasn't like she dropped Tell the bottle. Tell your wife, hey, if she get dropped you the bottle of Patron, she'd have got a spanking. Oh, oh damn. Yeah. Oh. But but no no um but it was just Cuervo. So it was just it was just margarita tequila. But at the same time, I was still yeah. It just the carelessness. Yes. And like for me, they don't care. I don't care about how smart they are. I don't care about if they can do a fucking algebra thing or if they get straight A's or whatever. I just want them to be good thoughtful people who actually are empathetic to other mm-hmm. people and want you know what i'm saying mm-hmm. like i don't care about any of the other shit mm-hmm. and when you're careless like that mm-hmm. it makes me really mad yeah you know what i'm saying yeah i'm sure you guys but i don't think that they think they're being careless they well, just they don't think that's, that's they're like it. my brain makes me do it my brain tells me do yeah is that what your that what your son says yes, my brain my brain won't tell me i don't know my brain <laughs> no nah. No, nah, I, 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 my. He I, tricky. He tricky. Your, your son's a little tricky though. Yeah. Because uh, you have a whole, s- you'll have a whole bit about your son in the, in your set. Oh, more than a, a bit. more than a do little. You, <laughs> uh, do you worry about later on when he's older mm, that, that he'll listen? That he'll it's listen. fine. We we have such a tight relationship. No, I'm not. I don't You're, think. Yeah. I don't. I, I wouldn't. I wouldn't worry if I was you. But I'm just saying. Like that's that's what I worry about. You know what it oh, is? Oh, really? No. Yeah. No, because because I because girls are different than boys. So mm-hmm. like girls are like I remember I had this bit Maybe. about I had this bit about um, my daughter being a Trump supporter and having her build a Lego wall around me, <laughs> and I only told it a few times 
only because I was worried because after a while, like she got older and she uh. wasn't one and a half anymore, and and she could she had her own voice and she. Well, she doesn't want to be a Trump supporter. No, but obviously she, no, she fucking here. hated Trump. Yeah, she, like, exactly. She, had, she she hated so of him. Course she would be no, mad. but then she saw that video of me oh. saying that she was, and she's like, "Daddy, I'm not a Trump supporter." And oh. they take it serious. And oh, they yeah. take it seriously. They They're like, get, "Why like, would you say that to everybody that I was a Trump supporter?" And I was it like, was "It's a just metaphor. a joke." And she's like, "I didn't even ever tell you to build a Lego wall. That's a lie." <laughs> <laughs> kids are kids are they, their wavelength is yeah. like yes. they don't understand like sarcasm and like the you know, mm. joking around. They like my kids are the same way. Like my son Silas, like he was like, um, he uh, what was it? He showed me the other day. He's like, look, Dad, I could shove a whole cucumber in my mouth, <laughs> and he just started. And I'm like, you can suck dick, huh? Yeah. <laughs> and I go, I go, uh, uh, that's not a good thing to do, Silas. He's like, why? And yeah. I'm like, oh, they don't yeah. get it. Like, yeah, they don't know it's about. Yeah. Sucking First dicks. of all, look, if he's gonna, if he wants to put a cucumber in his mouth, let him, <laughs> let him be Shut open up, to a cucumber <laughs> in his mouth. What's you know what? So what'd that? you say? What if, I say, if, if he enjoys a cucumber in his mouth, maybe I say good job. That's a good job. <laughs> yeah, good yeah. Job. I'm like, but man, was that all the way in, like, you I mean, want me? Is what do you want me to say? Go deeper. Is he choking? Was he, 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 he deep throating the cucumber? Was he putting his whole fist? My son likes to just, do that. Or was no, he just Chico, he doesn't put, put his fist in his put mouth. Put <laughs> my son does that. What is he this? He misses all my mom. and Watch. I'm like, good, good. I used to do that when I was a kid. Okay, I got a question for both you guys. Yeah. Like having kids, do you think it? And in being in the industry, is it harder for you guys to? be friends with other parents that are not for the kids sake like to like play dates and yes, stuff like that very much so i was i was just thinking about that like recently because oh my god i just had to do a big birthday party where this lady all she wanted to talk about was her uh, what, what are they called the, like migraine like sonic migraines or some <laughs> shit like she talk, yeah, talking about her fuck, fucking migraines weed, for bitch, 20 right? minutes <laughs> right and then she finally was like and the only relief i get is weed and i'm like why would oh. you, could you bring this up first this would be something we could talk about instead of your fucking oh i hate God. small talk no, that's I, I the hate, first thing yeah, i have I no energy small talk. or time for it i don't really i don't really have play dates with other parents at and all same i, I just meet my do son you tell i watch if you do have play dates do you tell other parents if they don't know already if you're a comedian like you tell I, I do have I d <laughs> no I, I the only play that I have is with my friend that's a, an actor and then his wife's a and professor she knows her, and they know already. they know they support me and then we don't talk about she like we, we're kind of just like huh right we just chill it's like mommy me time they're playing the kids are playing so we can like look at our phones and just sit there take a nap I don't know have mm -hmm. a drink <laughs> it's great so yeah that, that's nice it's nice when you can have when you have um a break with other parents that understand like yeah. th if they're in the industry or if they understand that you've yeah. been in the industry for a long like old friends yeah that's cool but like those new parents like when you yeah. when your kids go to a school and then they you have to meet the new parents yeah no i i almost i, I hate oh that. new parents yeah i, I, I look like shit. i'm snobbish i don't talk i'm just like Please don't talk to me. I'm thinking. Please, please <laughs> don't make eye contact. Don't no, I don't. I don't, really, I don't I look like I'm snobbish. I tell my wife already. I'm a snob. <laughs> I am. I don't like talking to folks. Yeah. I really don't. Yeah, I don't either. I just don't. Yeah, you I, see, a, I'm fruit fly. I'm trying to get it, but I want to get it. <laughs> I can't. I think I let them down. Like I feel like they want to be my friend, and I get you know a lot of dads that are like see me yeah. with because if I go to the park, you know how it is. Like mm -hmm. I'm not. I don't look like a dad, so yeah. they're gonna like. Is that your brother? They always think I'm a babysitter or like oh. the brother, older brother taking oh. them out. And they'll be like, and then when they find out and they're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. They'll try to conversate and <laughs> they'll be like, yeah, I'm, uh, we're going to be here next weekend if you want to. I'm like, oh, you're not going to want to be friends with me. You know, like it, <laughs> I just know. I, I, I know. already know that I, I in, in every case, because I live in Burbank. Uh. So every dude that I meet whose kid goes to a school in Burbank for the most part, like I'd say 80 percent are all straight edge. Like, if I were to even pull out a joint, they'd probably freak the oh fuck out. Oh, yeah. That's why I'm like, I have to not curse. I have to be mm, <laughs> just, you know. Right. So proper. Yeah. Our I hate lives, that. Our lives yeah. are so unorthodox yes. that these guys are clean, cookie cutter. Yes. They are lawyers. Yeah. They are, they have careers. Nurses, you know. office. Yep. I have a question for you guys about They wear button-up shirts. About yes. kids and comedy. <laughs> Do you guys swear in front of your kids? Oh, yeah. <laughs> do, you know I do already. You yeah. already know. That I know I do. you don't. <laughs> I do. You for do. Sure, yeah. You don't. Good for you if you don't. Yeah, I don't. I, I cannot. I don't. Like, no, I don't. Uh, only because I don't want them to be afraid of the words. Yeah, because they're gonna say fuck anyway some uh, someday. So might as well say it in front of me for sure. But not even just that. I don't want them to be afraid of it. Yeah, because like, my mom always said don't swear, don't curse, and then I end up cursing way more because <laughs> she tell me don't. I don't tell them uh, don't. I, I don't tell them I don't. Uh, 
<laughs> but they say stuff regardless already. Like they hear me say, because mm-hmm. I, I got a uh, parent teacher call the other day. He was like, oh, Shane said shit uh, while he oh. fell off the, the, the swing. Oh, oh. And well, I was yeah. like, well, well, shit. Yeah, like that's big deal. <laughs> you it know, is shit. Fuck, is he supposed to say? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, fun. He's supposed to say fun. I fell. <laughs> yeah. So it, and they just have to report it because all the other kids like it's a bad word, yeah. and then the parents freak but, out. But that's what blah, I'm blah, saying. Blah, blah. I don't want my kid to yeah. be that kid that's like, oh yeah. my god. Yeah. Oh, I know, right? It's uh, a big, s- not a big quiet. deal, right? Just, like my 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 six year old. Before she dropped the tequila, was like my daddy swears on a daily basis. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't matter. She's so cute. But but it, it's almost like it's the same thing. I would think like when my dad gave me a thing of liquor mm. when I was like fourteen or fifteen, mm. it demystified it. Mm. Like oh, it's not. But that now b- you're an alcoholic. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, you know what? You know what's weird? Are you doing a story, Danny? No, right now? Yeah, I'm on Snapchat. I've been thinking. Oh, what's up? I've been thinking about that like a lot since I have been drinking a lot. Uh, like, why are you drinking so much? I feel like it's really just because there's no, nothing else to do. <laughs> but you're busy now. You're doing your miscellaneous brown Girl, thing I am again. Not you're busy. You're not. We are not that busy. Oh. I am not that really? busy. No. <laughs> you seem like you're doing a lot of shows. Perception is reality. <laughs> That's real, but it's like, good to have downtime. No, it, you can't. No, and that's, you can't stand and that's, your own feelings. And, that, and no, and that's kind of what it. No, 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 no. And that's kind of what it. Because I'm like that sometimes. No, that's kind of what it, it. It boils down to is like I really just I like, and it's not like I. Drunk. You enjoy it. I enjoy it. Yeah. Like my dad, my husband is like that. My, too. my 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 dad used to say that when he was when he was younger, and and we used to live and he used to have this bar in mm. our in our house and he used to after after a hard day at work he would get a cigarette and he would pull you know get his Hennessy and pour his cognac and just do a little thing mm. and, and every it's night it's a nice just, ritual huh? it's just a nice little thing and then yeah. for me since we live in a uh-huh. tropical climate uh. I make a margarita sometimes for my wife sometimes oh, for nice myself mm. and it and I'm it's and I fun, used huh? I worked at a, I used to work at a you know one of those you know bubble gum shrimp so I I can make <laughs> Really good oh margaritas. Wow. You gotta invite us over for that. Oh, then. All His all house is nice. You I, love, there, yeah. I love. I nice. love. I love. I love making margaritas for everybody. Right, and like, night. like, but so like, I'm not like chugging a tequila uh-huh. bottle. I like make oh, a nice okay. margarita for oh, myself. It's and then. and that's kind of my little bit of enjoyment for quarantine. And unfortunately, it ended up becoming like a <laughs> daily routine. Now, happy hour every but then day. I, but then yeah, I started yeah, thinking yeah, about yeah, whether yeah. I'm gonna be. Am I alcoholic? Like, am I? Am I? Maybe a little bit. I don't and know. then I said, try not drinking for a month. Maybe a little bit. But then I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna use this at breaking the the tequila glass as a sign. Sign, yes. And I'm gonna say, you know what? I'm okay. Not gonna God have a says, Let's go drinking after this. <laughs> you know what? Instead, I'm gonna go drinking with Kiki and Danny. After oh this no, part. I'm good. I literally drank three nights in a row. Oh shoot, where'd yeah. you go drinking? Everywhere. So what did you guys do this weekend? What what? T- I want to hear about it. I I kicked it. I was I went to. Drink. Um, <laughs> yeah, I went to drink at like the Den. Have you guys been there? Did you do any I've shows heard of it. this weekend? No, no shows. I had three shows this weekend. You are a hustler. I am hustling. Like shit. Shit. How the hell do you get out I so d- many shows? I, I did. I don't know. People just you well because you know now. you know why because you book so many people and you give so many other people opportunity that oh, people are giving nice. you opportunity. No, that's real. That's that's that's, good. that's real. I mean, it's it's even like just the, the the fact of trading spots. People are seeing you give so many people opportunity. That well, yeah, it's and incredible. I never expect anything in return. You know, like I'm you know, but you that you want book great. You don't know. I'm not gonna yeah, yeah, beg yeah. for a spot. But if you think I'll be good on your show, thank you. I would love to do it. You like know? I, I wanted her to do the, the show on the twenty seventh, but then I was like, I was almost gonna ask her, but then I'm like, Golly, we, she we got could do so it later. many shows, and also Kiki's done my show many times yeah. before. Well, there are and, plenty of times, and I'm you're sure. gonna do sh- you. Both of you will Mother's always Day. do my show. Yeah, yeah. I, of course. She was the headliner for my Mother's that Day show fun. before the pandemic. Oh yeah, that yeah, fun. that was, that was fun. fun. Oh, it's just great. It's but just but so you went weekend, you went to the den. I went and to then the den. I went to some other spot. You know, just just willy nilly. I, I had this. Willy nilly. I have so much. Yeah, Willie's gone, right? So I'm over here like. Oh, you miss him. Willie's filming Willie his Mac. We're talking about. Yeah, he's Willie Mac. His black best friend. <laughs> Way to emphasis the black part. Just, just so people can <laughs> picture him, you know. No, but he's Willie. Very but handsome. you and Willie have really been I, like I compliment y'all on how like good BFFs. you guys have been doing it for a long time yeah, and doing comedy together for a long time. That's a good thing. When yeah. is he coming back? That's fun. That July. that must be fun to have like a, a yeah right a partner in comedy because this is a very can be a very lonely, lonely yep. profession. Yeah, yeah. Like, it was. It, he's a good dude, man. He's just a genuine guy. 
And mm-hmm. I think that's probably we we kicked we kicked it off pretty quickly, like what five years ago. Uh, we met oh. at a show, and uh, yeah, and just like he so. Was where is he now? He's in St. Louis filming for the HGTV. When is he coming back? Uh, July. So how long has he been gone? Uh, I think he's been gone like three weeks now. Oh, that's it. You miss him. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say that, Gigi. You said that. <laughs> we uh, miss him and you together. I miss Willie Mac. Dude, if he was here, I'd book both of you. <laughs> that's yeah, 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 yeah. Make you sit next to each other. <laughs> I remember. I remember. Oh, uh, so, so I'm only here because Willie Mac's not here. Is that what it is? It would be two of them and you right there. Sure, that's fine. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> no, I'm just I'm, kidding. I'm, I'm, no, you remember when I, I made a joke on with Teresa when you called in when Willie and I were doing a podcast? For oh, Teresa. that's funny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he was doing the Teresa Lowe's podcast uh, on YouTube. And then uh, I logged in, and I commented, and I was like, yo. And he's like, man, I'm trying to get my alone time with Willie Mac. Why are you going to treat me? Nobody like, can get alone time with <laughs> Willie no, Mac. No, except for Danny Plum. Mm, exactly. <laughs> so you went to the den, and went then what? Went to the what? den, and then I had, a, I had too much. I had to do a lot of self-tapes, so I couldn't oh, really. Oh, self-tapes. Yeah. Yeah, you're, so you're really doing those self-tapes. I am literally. Uh, now, like, you. A, the TV stuff Did is you buy a ring hard. Light? Huh? Did you buy a ring of light? Of course. I got some lights, yeah. Yeah. You gotta you gotta compete in the yeah, streets, man. I know. <laughs> I, I gotta I gotta get a me a long p- tripod with the freaking that little thing to put the phone on now because I'd be using my stack of books. Yeah. And I have my ring light, but it, I got my bus softbox and I, I put a freaking curtain right. behind me. You gotta be on point, dude. You no, can no you got to. You can book <sighs> those things. So you booking? Uh so now I'm uh, so I get like these the okay, commercial scripts uh-huh. are easy. Yeah. I'm getting these TV show Great. stuff now, and it's like a lot yes, of lines, guys. Yes. Yo, yo, yes, so I had one Danny for Plum, like five Danny Plum, <laughs> Danny Plum. Uh-huh. I am gonna start an acting class for stand-ups and <laughs> reverse, reverse stand-up class for actors. Those, that's the two classes I'm gonna start because straight up, that's where I know I could help because I can act my ass off. <laughs> I'm just, mm. No, and, mm. I, and no, it's just real. Like I, I can memorize scripts really well. Mm. Like I don't want. I'm almost hesitant to tell this story only because. The movie's still filming, but like I got, I, I auditioned and got called back cool. for, for a, a pretty big movie. Yeah, and then found out in Variety that I didn't get the role, which I was oh. like, wow, that's that's okay. I'm like, okay, I'm I'm kind of okay with the fact that yeah, yeah, yeah. Var- the the person that got it was in Variety. But anyhow, I yeah, think yeah. you always need a reader. That's yeah, what you like, do. You yeah. need a reader. Because before I was recording my own freaking <laughs> lines, and then I'm like, this is not working. So I have my friends helping me through Zoom, but it's still not the same. No, you know? but uh, if you have acting scripts, bro, seriously, let me help you because yes, I'll help bro. you. I'll help you book. I started taking. Help well, me book. I have, <laughs> I have so too. many. St- no, I but have that's three or four every like week. I've like been trying to figure out a side hustle regular, for the longest damn time in LA. Roles, uh, and if I'm not going to oh. book in LA, I'll fucking help people, other people book because. I don't even have an agent. I've done everything that you've seen in front of you with no agent, you no manager. No agent? I have a commercial agent you that want me to sends refer me out every you six. To my agent? Hey, uh, uh, okay, <laughs> so let's just be the clarion call. Let's get Eric Esteban an agent or a manager that How can help you? him do stuff. Who's your agent? Uh, I just got one. Oh, cool. That's why things are. I, Who's um, who Aqua. Oh, the they're good. I've yeah. Heard good yeah. Thing. See, I haven't had. I'm an with an uh, image here. powerhouse. I've I've been with I've been with Stewart Talent since I've been in Chicago. And Good. Stewart still represents me commercially, but they don't represent me mm. theatrically. So we'll see what happens. But yeah, I'm. I'm. But they. You still also can submit on Actors Access. And the, and they and and what was a trip was the movie that I just auditioned for. It was my Chicago agents that called me in. Oh, on it. interesting. And had and what the interesting thing don't they was, know anybody in L.A. That was no, but the thing was was that they told me that the L.A. agents couldn't get me an audition. Because there were too many Filipinos uh, in LA, uh, yep. So I can they see got that. Damn. so Good. they ended up getting nice. me the audition through Chicago. Interesting. Because there were, so it was like, oh, mm. so yeah, maybe it's a, it's sometimes it's an advantage and sometimes it's a disadvantage. You want to you want to a funny story? This is I, <laughs> so I booked a, I did I booked a show Family Time oh. on a, and I was playing the sixteen year old boyfriend <laughs> right yeah. to this and it was, you know you know Family Time it's like all black uh-huh. cast yeah so. <laughs> I booked it. Uh, the contract, that, so they're like, oh, they'll send the contracts tomorrow. And then tomorrow hit, and I didn't get contracts. And I was like, oh, okay, is this how it works, you know? <laughs> and so nothing came. The next day, nothing came. And then the film, we were filming uh, that following Monday. And I was like, uh, do I just do I just show up? Uh, like, do I do it? And then they, they emailed back and said, <laughs> I have one approved. And then the I, I, one of the producers said no because we uh, I was Asian. Oh, god. Well, they didn't want to say that. Oh, but they that were like, sucks. They were like, oh, no, because he's. We want to keep it um, black. 
not black, but what's the word? African American. Uh, not even that. They uh, were color. like uh not that either. <laughs> but it was like it was uh it was in that realm of uh Diversity. let's keep yeah, like let's keep it appropriate for what we currently and I was like oh. so in something, that direction. Something, something to the effect of like in that creative direction. direction. In, yeah, in, yeah. in our, in our own creative direction. Yeah, and I was like, what is oh okay. You Some painted your nail? Yeah, cool. I did. I'm trying something By new. Yeah. Interesting. I just glue my. She's called me out on the on the no, podcast. No, because I see see it. <laughs> yes, you <laughs> trying to get out off. metrosexual? Ma- ma- manicure? Huh? You do a manicure? I have not. I hate those. <laughs> those Asian ladies go crazy, bro. They yeah, like bro. They cut you, cut your cuticles. I don't go. All yeah. I just do my own. But back to your den story. What were you <laughs> saying? Um, Come on, let's let's let him finish. No, no, this is a weird thing for me. I like to go out uh. by myself, and I just be dancing. Oh, nice. And I like. No one knows this, but like I just go and like no one knows. I'm just in the corner and I'm like vibing out, Whoa, and fun. then people will come and hang out and dance, and uh, and then like and and you know that's just what I do. So and it's like a it's like a little release that I do oh, because I need that you know no one you. knows no you one knows me. Yep, I just in the corner. That's great. And I and I drink and I do my thing and then oh. uh. Fine. So that's that's what I do. So next time when I see a weirdo in the corner, that'll be Danny Plum. <laughs> that's me. That's me. <laughs> Yo, no, uh, there, there's something to that though to just be the anonymous dude in the oh, bar that's, that's just chilling and just and just drinking and listening to the music. Where'd you you can go dancing now? Uh, no, but now um it, everything's kind of open. Let's you go know? dancing. It's a trip though. Everything's open, but it's still a trip. Like yeah. I'm still I got my I got my mask in my pocket still. Yeah. Last, last night I walked into the uh actually the den. And uh-huh. nobody was wearing a mask except for me. Oh yeah, and feels I'll, weird, huh? Yeah, they're like, what the fuck, yeah. motherfucker, are you not vaccinated? I was like, but still, <laughs> yeah, I was in the exactly. Ralphs, and it was a trip because it was only older white men that did not have masks. Everyone oh. else still had masks. Oh. Mm. Everywhere I go, a lot of people don't wear masks anymore. That's I went to the tr- gym, no mask, Gold's Gym, and I went to I went to grocery store. Yeah, people were taking it off. Yeah, no, I, even outside. I'm happy though. Don Man. Melrose, I, I, I kind of am, oh, but I also, I'm, I'm, I'm always. Just gonna, be careful. I'm gonna say that yeah. I want to always wear a mask, like in grocery stores. Oh, I don't know about that. I, no, I can't I'm, stand. I, I'm real. getting these chin acne. I, I yeah, can't. Stand. I'm the same chin way, but I'll just get some acne medicine for my doctor because Damn. look, I, I would rather have acne than the flu, or oh. get sick. And I didn't get sick the whole time, this whole year. Like between, <laughs> we're, no, we're not knocking on wood shit. right now, guys. No, we're but you know, but but, and I know that's because of the mask. It's because really, we, yeah, there wasn't even the the oh. flu cases were down this year, like everything was down this year because or because you didn't go anywhere. No, no, no. I still went. I had to go shopping for my parents. I you must sh- have had some high quality mask, like double, triple mask. Yeah, I, I would double mask and have billionaire and boys have club mask. Yeah, because <laughs> I, I don't think that mask work if it's thin. No, I had, I had, I, I would, I would do the double plexi? mask with the, with the with the plexi. I was scared, but also I was scared because I was shopping for my parents. <laughs> okay, so okay, I, would, yeah, that's true. I wouldn't want to like. Last thing I would want to do is bring it yeah. home to them. For sure. How old are your parents? For sure. They're in their seventies, and my dad's diabetic, and my mom survived cancer. She had cancer when they were thirties, wow. but. She's still like her health has never been one hundred percent since. So oh, it's like yeah. that Filipino you know. blood, huh? What'd you do over the weekend? You so you drank margaritas? Well, I'm, I drank margaritas and watched TV. Cool. I mean, that's all I did. My friend had a birthday, so I had three shows. I went to two strip clubs. I went to the one what? across from the comedy store. You know that one? They have strip clubs now. Yes, they. It's like always been there. Motley Crue filmed his f- music video there. Apparently, my friend said. Now, He's like, how I do you get go. a lap dance during a pandemic? Do they oh, still do no, it? No, they're fucking. I watched him get a lap dance. And it's so all. All seedy cubicles, and then you know, you know they're, all naked. They're, all naked. Naked, they're all naked. They're all naked. No, mask. they don't wear the mask. <laughs> they're all naked, and I'm just like, wow, you, she let you touch her tits and her ass. Okay, and Whoa. that was like forty dollars. Wow, that's Los Angeles. Yeah, yeah. $40? And then on the, the 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 pool of all these young girls, they look like they're like fit tw- twenty one, and I'm just I want to mom bad. them. They look so sad. They they can't even yeah, dance. No, they I just can't. go. Like, they're totally naked because it's no. Uh, it's after two. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah and it was his birthday so i was like okay we'll go like we've been friends forever so he's a guy so i'm like yeah we'll go and then and then uh, th- they're like picking up like the, the dollar bills like they're they're dogs like they're, they don't even dance or know how to pop like they just i'm just like oh this is horrible i'm like Ugh. oh but so i'm wondering whether it, kiki i'm gonna i'm asking you just by the way you're telling this story whether it is you're feeling sorry for the girls because they're strippers or you're feeling sorry because they can't work it 
They, they can't work it. I'm feeling bad for them because they can't work it. So Saturday, we went to another one in North Hollywood, and they were amazing. It was like See? the Hustler was on. They were up on the pole. They were like Jennifer Where Lopez. Uh, Spearman or whatever. You, it's Spe- it. Spearman it. Rhino. Check yeah. Oh, my gosh. They're so good. They're like spinning. I'm like, oh, shit. I was like trying to take tips. It was great. We went late, so they let us in free even. Uh, Spearman Rhino is like a chain. It's great, though. They were like, it's a club. The music was great. Playing all the Tupac old school hip hop. Yeah, no. 90s rock music. I was like, this is awesome. And then the girls can really spin. It it really is. They can spin like, I was like. And they can go, their butt goes, and I'm like, wow, then I, I need to take notes how you do amazing. that. It's they're amazing. It's amazing. They're amazing. The one yeah. across from Comedy Store, if you just want to go hang out, there's a bunch of young guys. They just, you know, they just prance around, and then they pick them up. They go to, you know, into the private lap dance room. But it's not enjoyable for me. They're not, they don't have skills. No, it, like, uh, it looks sad. A strip joint should be fun. It looks because, sad Because, uh, I mean, me. really, like, But it was know. packed. Like, it's a strip joint should be the second, not the first. Yeah, I it was packed the first. You never you been to one? Well, no, no, sorry. I haven't gone to one since I was, like, 19 because I, I fell in love w- with a stripper. Yeah, T-Pain. Yeah, I literally you did. You fell in I love? Fell love? There, was this, oh, damn, there was this girl, and, uh, you know, when you're young, you're like, oh, man, she was so into me during that lap dance. I'm like, I'm she sorry. just sold oh, it. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Her name was Sandy. My friend spent $200 <laughs> on the stripper, like, Look, I after spent, he got I a $200. I spent $300 on, on a stripper and knew she didn't like me just because I had the money. Yeah, like, they're, they're really good. They're I know, really hustling. I know strippers don't like... They're, they're, really they're good just at good. Talking. They're good at hustling they have you to. out of money. It's just like, ooh, I have... Oh, if, like, I remember this one stripper because I wear ripped jeans all the time. <laughs> mm, right? like, ooh. And she was like, ooh, let's buy another dance. And she put her hands all the way up my oh, ripped shoot. jeans. And Did she like, rip them? And, like, like fingertipped my dick. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Like that got like, Paul's attention. Like the next dance Ooh, was gonna be. I might grab yeah. it and you know give yeah, you a little yeah, handy yeah. Uh, oh. for this strip job. And, yeah. and I'm like, so if this next dance gets me a <laughs> hand job, I'm Ooh, wondering I'll how much this is gonna cost the whole me. F- I'll empty out my whole bank account, right? I mean, I had cash on me. I just uh, booked, they have I, ATMs I, I, there, so I have national. I, I had national commercial oh, yeah. money at the time. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. Ooh. I was not thinking. Oh, damn. That's how you spend your money. Oh, when I was young $30 and stupid. $30 masks? Hell yeah. $30 masks and $300 lap dances, apparently. 300 yeah. Well, now you have two daughters. Do you feel yeah. bad for those girls? That no, I don't feel bad for the girls that got my money. No, hell no, I don't, got <laughs> they got I don't feel bad. They got paid for their <laughs> services, and we were both happy at the end of it. I'm not like, uh, I wasn't insisting on anything, and I knew that they didn't like me, and true. it was cool. That's but true. they did what they were going to do, and yeah. it... You know, some of the stuff is still in my spank bank. Okay, so how do you guys release your your stress? Like, I know we were talking to Jason and Shang. They did they do some some watch a lot of porn or <laughs> they meditate. <laughs> how do you guys deal with you know the pandemic all through this? You know, now we're getting back to normal. But how do you deal with <laughs> your stress? Damn fruit flies! Dang, it's coming after me, bro. It wants to eat you. Your your skin is sweet. I'm saying, oh, that's just, that's a good way to put it. That's what my grandma used to always say. Yeah, your, your skin, skin is, is sweet. sweet. That's why. The mosquitoes all be wanting. Yummy, yeah. yummy. I think it's like that Southeast Asian blood. Yeah. You know what I mean? That Cambodian. Mm, they don't like my blood. Yummy, uh, they, they used yummy. to like my blood. They don't like it anymore now that it's California blood. There's too much <laughs> cannabis in it now. They're like, damn, Man. I'm going to get high if I eat this motherfucker. But how do you I, guys release your... I... So my, do, do you de- how you de-stress? I de-stress by uh, staying busy on thing other things. So I was making like a lot of content, you know, mm. like these TikToks. Blown up on TikTok. Right. And, you know, and, and these stupid videos now on Instagram. Like I do it because it's like, okay, it blows up. It gets people laughing and mm-hmm. I just, you know. Why not? And I create those. You're spreading joy. Yeah. Yeah. You know, it's like, eh. People mm. laugh. That's, that's great. That's what it is. Your game is strong. Your TikTok game is Yo, your, your your inst- strong. Yo, your, your internet game is strong. Your social networking game is strong. It's like a whole other job. It's, it's, a, it's, it's a, a whole, and, and it's a whole other art oh, form than, yeah. than what we do as, as far as on stage. It's a totally different yeah. thing. Yeah. Because it's so much faster and so you have to retain attention. It's so funny you said that. You don't like it's so funny because these videos they're different. I used to post a lot of comedy stuff in the beginning, uh-huh. and that didn't get any huh. traction. And I'm like, what the fuck? Uh. So I'm like, so I had to trial and error a lot uh-huh. of things, uh-huh. and then I'm like, let me just like I want because my audience, I think it's because I look young, so uh-huh. the algorithm pushes only to young kids, uh. like teenagers, uh-huh. like so I was like, uh. I made these videos and it would push out like 
millions of views. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, is that what they like? Oh. So then I kept doing it. What? What do you? I have. What was seen. it that you're doing? It's so. It's so dumb. So dumb. Great. It's like what? I sit in a mirror, and <laughs> with some music playing, and 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 I put some font like, like I'll put like a, <laughs> like, girls who grew up with sisters are better or brothers are they are better than girls who grew up with just sisters and that's something like that right? Okay. And then two million views later, two million two views? million views later, hundred thousand comments. Like, all this crap. And I'm like, wow. I'm like, so I just kept doing that. And then it's awesome. like, and it pushes out. Because if you see my followers, uh -huh. it's like, it's growing, but only only with these, like, high school kids. Yeah. But that's who's on the internet. You, yes. Though. Most of the time that have time to keep watching, yeah. watching, right. scrolling, scrolling. But, but, but before when I was putting, like, you know, really thoughtful, mm -hmm. creative oh, <laughs> So sketches. maybe I should stop doing that. But what does my no, face see, look like, though? But that's I don't look. You gotta let IG tell you. I, <laughs> for me, yeah. that's part of why I kind of stop, uh, like being so on social. Like, I, if I have a oh. show to promote or I oh. have something, uh -huh. then cool. But if not, I don't want to uh. just put stuff out there yeah, to yeah, get views. Just to like, yeah. for me, like I'd rather. And I, this is no, this is no knock on you. I'm not trying. No, to No, no, not at all. I, 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 for myself, would rather like write a really good sketch, and even if it only gets two hundred, even if my homies only watch it. I'd rather make my homies laugh than. No, I got you. You know what I mean? Yeah. Here's, and, and maybe I'm not, maybe, and maybe, maybe it's because I'm old. I don't know. Yeah, you old. I'm old. <laughs> I am old. I am old. I'm old too. Here's but, the difference. But yeah, if you if so, like my TikTok is not that at all. My TikTok, like it has a, a huge following too, but it's uh, only interviews. I do like quick interviews on the street. And I'll do I'll, like I'll pick. No, up. I saw those. I right. saw those. Oh, yeah. I haven't seen them. I gotta yeah. watch them. So I'm never on TikTok. I should I, get on it. I it's stopped. just a whole other thing I have to focus. You know. Yeah, and it's another. It, like it's too like much. I can't do work. it. It's another I'm creative dying. form that you have to figure out what yeah. your niche is. And yeah. I'm like, yeah. I'm already trying to figure out what my niche is in stand up comedy. I'm cool. I'm just gonna figure out. Keep on figuring that so out. So Instagram is easy. I think I've seen those. You're still doing those. Yeah, right? I still do those. Those are cool because you like to dance. And you have a shit ton of followers. You have like eleven thousand some followers, right? I think no. TikTok is like over a hundred, but like on uh, Instagram is only like uh, I think it's at like seven thousand now. But oh, like, yeah, but really? it's growing but it's because growing. you're doing yeah, that. But it's See, growing. I want to grow mine too, and I f I notice every any time I post reels, I get a lot of views, mm -hmm, like mm -hmm. a thousand, a few thousand more than I usually. Right. So, well, but because I, reels I, are the new thing on Instagram, yeah, so that's what people are watching. But I haven't had get time to do a lot. So, what would you recommend me? T you, you know, real guru right here, Danny <laughs> Plum. What yeah. do you see my face? What yeah. should? What would you want me to do? I think. Um, I will do it. <laughs> I think your sketches are good. If if you make them shorter, oh, like you mean the crazy vocations? Yeah. Oh, those are just no. But like, let's say let's say if you made more of those. Those are just up to the comedians. They're making uh, it a minute. But those are just I'm putting there to pro. But but new content that I would have to make because we're the final showdown Yo, is Kiki, this Saturday. What you're doing no, right Kiki, now, my what you're doing right now is great. Like oh, I haven't this? been posting that much. Here's my advice: post uh uh once a week on the same time, same day, uh. so the algorithm reg remembers it. Okay. And I would I would do single person sketches for yourself. Yeah. So you're acting with yourself. With okay. So uh, yeah, I did that hey, little give me the bit. Thing, and then your wig yeah. goes. I'm not doing it. Yeah, and it's yeah. like, well, let me take it. And okay. it's like one of those. So is that original? I see so many people doing that, but especially you, Asian girls. If They're you write your own. Yeah, it'll be original. they're original when they're I your voice. Some. I did some where I put on another page. Yeah, I did one where and I talk about being young or pretty. What or I would say is this for me, and I think this is true for any content. If it's funny to you, yeah, and it, put and it, it up. And, it, and it speaks to you, mm -hmm. then put it out. But I just want it to be consistent. So every time I'm like, okay, today, this is why I don't want to think, oh, what that's the I hardest part I, is consistency. I just want to. So you here's know? here's my advice for that. I yeah. know a lot of cr creators uh -huh. that are like have way more followers than me, uh -huh. and they gave me this advice. They said, get your notepad, have those things pre-planned. Yep. So yeah. every video, you aren't thinking that day. You already yeah. have it right here. You can right. Yeah. I would. Oh, and then what if I don't feel like doing that one that day? See that I'm not doing uh, like that's, that. But that's I'm no. But that's where like the that. consistency comes in because like when to I do it, when <laughs> I was doing a podcast, okay. like the podcast, the pandemic killed my podcast. Because remember when I was doing crazy funny. But agents? why don't you keep doing it? Because I was because I love the face to face thing. Now I'm gonna oh. start doing it oh, again. Oh, good. But. I loved inviting people into my home, getting them pastries, making them coffee. Having I coffee. didn't get that. Yes, you did. Did you get pastries? Yes, you did. I, or coffee? No. Yes, you did. I didn't get did not. shit. She didn't. No. Okay, well, I've <laughs> God, maybe I the damn. first few years. Who the <laughs> maybe <laughs> Kelvin <laughs> Hanyi got the, got the, the pastries. But no, no, but anyway, no, but like I, 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 I liked inviting people into my home, 
and 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 then kind of getting to know them on yeah. a level like and they would share stories with you that were different from like if they did it in yeah. the studio so but yeah. when the pandemic hit yeah we weren't going face to face anymore and then mm -hmm. i didn't know about zoom but yeah but consistency well yeah. the only reason i'm I saying mean, is I like consistency those. is I like, like these like i would put these up but but i'm talking about the ones that like you do i want to do something that way that shows a different side of my personality that's comedic mm. that's people haven't seen that i don't share like but it's really me it you would know definitely be something on danny's thing, thing then where do you, you know know I mean? play a character that you're speaking to like yeah like i could do that those but that then i always end up playing like the mom thing which is fine because it's kiki okay, funny better mama. Idea, kiki what? here's another one you could do, and I uh, like you can do um, in the mirror. Uh. Um, it can be in the bathroom, and it can be all this. These are all your videos. Uh huh. Is because you know how you make a lot of rants. I do. So yeah, you, you do. Literally go in the mirror and be like, so you have your phone, and you're really talking in the mirror, and you're like, why do old people always do that? And that's it. Oh my god, I have so much shit that annoys the shit out of me. That's I should it. just do that. That's the easiest. That's thing. the easiest thing. Like like Boom. like right. I just. Put my face on, dress. And just do. Why and do you got to always go about and it's Or quick. I'll just be talking shit about my son, all the things that he and seconds. my husband. Danny, okay, can I ask you a question? I, I, I want to ask you a question. Okay, yeah. so I'll try that. Those people that have a lot of followers, is it is it also about a consistency in as far as the background and the shot and like how it looks? Yeah. Yeah, it has to be that's consistent what I too. video see, types. That's what I see when I see like larger follow people with larger followings and you, you just kind of scroll their feed. And it's the same type. It mm. looks like the same shot because, in everything. Because their algorithm recognizes oh this okay. is your brand right this yeah. is your brand mirror, so so like and i do this because and talk it's not just like build like it does work like if you get an uh, engagement that's uh -huh. all like if you have eyes on it you can use that my thought process was like let me just build an audience yeah and then uh spread joy that's and how that's no, how my reps repped out to me they but found my TikTok, oh, and yes, wow. and that's part of the reason Aqua why I reached out to you. Because yeah, and that's Good part of the you, reason man. why I am asking about it because as much as I'm adamant about trying to you keep gotta it, do it man. Qual quality versus quantity, I'm trying to I'm I'm in the same boat as Kiki in that I'm trying to find Good something talk. to build an audience online right. because I'm gonna tell you, not having an agent, and I haven't had an agent, right? Right, right, I, right, right We've right. already established Ooh. that. It, you don't have an agent. If you don't have numbers online, you need some. Yeah. That's the first question that they ask you. Huh? Isn't that crazy? That's what they ask you these days. Th yeah, they, but don't, does the they don't care really that I've like been on the best stages in Chicago but, but and in LA the, as an actor. They don't the, care about do shit. Do those numbers They're, really translate? They onto don't people because half of them are bought. Because Shang and, and, and Jason and I were talking about, do they? If you have five hundred thousand, do they come see you at the show at no. the, sh the store? Like uh, sometimes when I book certain com comics that have a lot of volume, they don't have people I, show up for them. I don't think of it that way. I think of so the way I'm building an yes. audience. Yeah. Is I don't think of it. If I do a show here, they're gonna come. Yeah, um, mm -hmm, I think mm -hmm. of it as I use it in meetings. Yeah. So when I have these pitch meetings, so with, you smart, know, Danny. Yeah. No, and you're so smart. So you're smart. very smart. So but like, I, I do love those videos. They always tickle me. They are quality <laughs> too. That's why I'm like. Do they tickle so, you? They tickle me. They do. It's so genius. No, but you bro, you found like something you with with within your 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 but personality that has that clicked with people, and that's a great thing. And that's I think what we're all trying to do, even with just our comedy in general, is like trying to find. I just want to do a it. A little just, thing that clicks. Yeah, just do it just for fun for me. Because I do have, I need to rant. And, you know, it's like hard for me to, yeah. I can only rant so much to my, my husband and he can't, <laughs> or my son, you know. So the mirror is perfect. Yep. So even if there's a light, no. There yeah. No, you, you don't need it. I, you just yeah, literally do okay. it like, it's like this. It's like, uh, you just, it's 15 I'm seconds. I'm going to credit you for this. No, don't have to. One of the videos are going to blow up. That's how it's going to work. Just keep doing you it. Just that Mike do it. was talking about. Mike is, Mike is going to be on See, another podcast. And, 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 and he just posts The thing that, that he happens he with me is that I, I, I literally creatively <laughs> can't do the same video again. Mm. You know what I'm saying? You find your stride where you find and something new. And it's fine. New. It's fine. No, you but, but you know what I'm saying? Like a consistent, like same type of rant type of thing. I, oh, I, I have, have so I, many I, different type of rants. Or, uh, well, and maybe I, I will not stop. I just I, once <laughs> the Pandora box open, it's gonna happen. But that's what I'm saying. Yeah. I love it. You're those, so look at those consistent. It, it all I looks the same. It. It, yeah, yeah. But Kudos that's what I'm saying. Kudos to you, man, Danny. And and and, and I for myself, I like I get, I get I get <laughs> mad at myself when there's not you, variety, man. and maybe that's just my brain. You look so cute too, like a little. No, like like a that's teenage another thing. boy, man. They always, that's the thing. They, I, I, These kids are like, oh, you know, so cute. They, they just. They but he's actually a daddy. <laughs> <laughs> can give you some daddy lessons. Ew, no, but no, no, ew, no, ew, but ew, no, ew. but no, but no, not in that way, sicko. Oh, that's okay. not what I'm thinking. Like daddy, like 
We, Not like that. First of all, Kiki, we Damn. are all thinking that as soon as you said <laughs> it. <laughs> well, I wasn't thinking, so that's all that matters, and I said it. But <laughs> that's the hard part. But is I, think, I think I would wear, like, dresses, like, because that's what I like to wear, like, like dresses and not look like a mom, but just start renting, like, you know, like a, a mom or whatever things yeah. that's going on with Mom me. rants definitely are popular online. There's, like, I, I, I know this one lady who just lip syncs on TikTok, <laughs> but she lip syncs, like, like songs that you wouldn't think this little white lady's lip syncing, oh. and it like millions I and used millions to do the career and, and I'm karaoke. watching them they're hilarious oh yeah uh, but I think what you, you hit on something about about it being a consistent same kind of shot same type of thing so that you get yep. your algorithm that gets picked cool. up and, and I'm you gonna get do followers that in yeah. three that's months. definitely something that you guys yes anybody listening that wants to get a following on the in, on internet is def that's definitely that's great advice I'll do, do that for three months and then I'll come back if it doesn't work I'm gonna kill yes. you I'm gonna stab you with a fork <laughs> <laughs> you better do it at the same time Pick a day. Shit, is it daytime or nighttime? You gotta just pick a time. It doesn't matter. So if it's 6 p.m. on Wednesday, you better post 6 p.m. on Wednesday every week. All right, well, sir. That's what it was. Okay, too. I, think, I think that's what it was with the podcast right. that I did. Like, All even right. if you just consistently post, like, you've, you're you're accumulating. Yeah. I did that for a while, but I didn't see anything different. So y I stopped. But I'll do that because you you're can. telling me I can. I can. Yeah, no, and try I will. And especially, I think, with this podcast, too, Kiki, because you're going to have a, a big chunk of things where you can oh, plan Oh, yeah, we're going we're gonna to plan and, this and, out, and, of and course. But you, this might be your little niche that blows up because this is a good thing you're bringing in all these voices oh yeah, that no love normally it. people don't I love hear it. from and I, I it's i i i purposely do it this way where we're not interviewing each other because people want to know about us they can google find yeah. out i just wanted to chat and talk shit and talk about whatever what, well what what is the day in the life of a, a asian american comedian you or know just I mean? or you know, even a comedian even, in just, general just, just a person like, being and it a just dad happens to be Ki you know kiki that is yeah. uh so okay, we're gonna wrap it up and play a game. Okay, okay just kay. whatever. Let's do it. Whatever comes in my mind. Uh, word association diapers. Mm. Thank God I'm done with them. Yeah, expensive. <laughs> um, I wish they had adult diapers. Well, they do. They do, don't they? They, they do. do. Have, they're called Depends, and and I'm he probably gonna know. need them sooner. Yeah, than later. Mister. <laughs> yeah, because the the farts be turning into sharts more times than <laughs> yeah. not. It's just true. <laughs> okay, pot tie or or adobo. Pad Thai. Pad Thai. Damn, you said pad. Aha! Not coming from a Filipino guy. Bro, come on, man. I don't like Filipino food. I've they, never they, had adobo. They, they, really? would, they would take my I Filipino card if Be they if knew you don't like. Well, food. no, I mean they. Too salty. They, every, most people know. No, I just don't like it. I was fat when I was a kid because I ate too much Filipino food. And <laughs> when you put sugar and hot dogs in your spaghetti, then you're oh, probably gonna it's get so fat. Oh, so good. No, I've never I'm had adobo. Sugar. Oh, really? Uh, for real. It's I, good no, I chicken. make good adobo and I like adobo, but I would. Definitely prefer adobo what is it? and um, margaritas at his house. No, but I would definitely prefer it's pad chicken. thai because I don't know how to make it, so I pick pad oh. thai. Adobo is like chicken marinated. Yeah, marinated with vinegar and soy sauce oh, and, so and salty bay leaves. And good. It's really? very good. It's, I'm it's, hungry now. It's very good. Mm. Um, okay, if you die today, okay, if I die today, I would like to mm. go to a strip club. <laughs> Let's go, Danny. <laughs> <laughs> Skydive. Oh yeah, I want to do that. I'm if I if I if I knew I was dying that day, I'd probably schedule a skydive in the morning at least, so I could say that I did it once. Because now I'm scared to do it. Maybe mm. jump like to your old. death. That'd mm. be nice. But even then, yeah, that that'd be fine. If I knew I was dying that day anyway, I'd be like, fuck it, let's skydive. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, the love of your life. Who's the love of it, your life? Ooh. Uh, Kristen Stewart from Twilight. <laughs> I was about to say Alyssa Milano from Who's the Boss. Oh, <laughs> she's cute. Bella, that's my crush, man. Bella, she's huh? Oh, and then uh, and then uh, uh, what's her name? Uh, uh, Chitara from Thundercats. Oh, I don't damn! Oh. Chitara from Thundercats was fine as <laughs> hell. Oh my god! Even we need now, to show I, a picture. I'm, I, I, well, I'll say like we we talked about it in the beginning. I'm, I, I've masturbated to Thundercats. Mm. So. <laughs> mm. I get Damn. that stuck in my brain. <laughs> I can't, uh, uh, can't get with you on that one, Eric. <laughs> <laughs> um, um, last, last question. What do you think? <laughs> I'm, I'm distracted now. You're distracted at me. If I get to meet Bruce Lee, what would I say to him? Do you like water? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'd probably cry. And say nothing. <laughs> uh, I'd probably cry and be like, thank I, you. I wear your shirt every day. Yeah. I wear your shirt all the time. I'm in love with you. 
with you. I wear your baby I masturbate to your to to. I don't to, masturbate to, to Bruce enter Lee, the dragon. <laughs> I don't. Okay, never mind. Masturbate to enter the dragon. <laughs> Only My to dick Chitara. is hard, but it's not. Oh, from, dick is hard. Okay, it's a different kind of excitement. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, how do people find you on social media? Mm, just look me up. Danny Plums 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 P L O M S P L O M S is that yes. how you spell? See, I think I don't know how to spell my own Plums, Plums. Plums, Plums. Yeah. I don't have You'll a lot of me. followers. TikTok. I have Eric Esteban at Twitter, and then I have Miscellaneous Brown at Instagram, and then, yeah, so. You got shows coming up. Miscellaneous Brown. Miscellaneous Brown. At the Brew Yard. The, at Brew Yard. Is it, will this, Glendale, Will right? this be out before? The uh, no. But you will keep having it, though. Yeah, no. We'll, we It'll always, be in July. We we're, always do, we always we'll do Miscellaneous Brown's Karaoke Comedy Spectacular. Kiki's been on it. Danny mm-hmm. basically it's funny. Kelp, you can helps sing karaoke. me co-host it sometimes. <laughs> you sing karaoke and you do stand-up comedy. I love hosting. It's yeah. so fun. You should, you should have I, I me co-host hosting. that karaoke shit because I, I used I, to I, be a karaoke queen. I would, I would also want to... I'm going to put that out there. I love hosting, so I would love to host... It would be an honor to host one of the crazy woke Asian shows, too. I'd love that. Oh, okay. So you could we could trade hosting spots. I'll let you host... Miscellaneous Brown, you could, and I'll host one of your shows. I love that shit. You like co-hosting. Okay. I love um, hosting. Um, yeah, anything else? Last words or words of wisdom to a young comic mm. who's just like starting out. Don't tell me some bullshit like stage time and keep writing. Something di- deeper, like different, like, you know, something pe- you wish people said to you when you were starting out. You know what I mean? Mm. Aside from stage time and writing. You got something? No, I'm thinking. Okay, I got some. Okay. okay, I'll say the first thing that mm. was told to me. Mm. Um, Sharna Halpern, who opened up uh, Improv Olympic in Chicago, mm. she was my first teacher mm. in Chicago. And the first day of the first class of my first improv class, she said, every comic should read the newspaper. Oh. Every day. That's great. Because. I don't. Or at least, if not, if not read the newspaper, you don't have to read the newspaper, but be. Aware of current and, events. And, and, and aware of current yes. events and what's going on in the world. Yes. Because your job is to speak about the world and yes. speak about your perspective of the That's world. Great. So you need to understand and have a perspective yes. of the world. So you need to understand what's That's going amazing. on in the world. That's amazing. So yeah. That's a great word of wisdom. Mm. Danny, top that. Damn, I can't. Uh, <laughs> just know you're going to suck for a, a long time. Mm. Yeah, that too. You know? Mm. Um, and mm. also, uh, mm. p- don't listen to people who, who tell you that you are... Uh, you know, you, you're not supposed to do this or you uh, can't, you know, uh-huh. like that's it. Don't tell people, don't listen to people who tell you you're not funny, because if it's funny to you, then it's funny. Yay! Like, like you're you are yourself and uh, nobody can be you. Yes. You know what I mean? So yeah. like, Just like Danny, watch him on, on Instagram <laughs> and TikTok. And uh, yes. yeah, that's that's the best thing, because I remember there was a comic. I'm not going to name him. But and, uh, and he back in the day, he was like shit on me hardcore i was just starting out let's just what six years ago oh yeah. damn yeah and he would just be like dude you don't you're so like you don't have you don't know how to set this up you're not Did like you tell him go fuck himself i just didn't listen to him you know good for <laughs> you. but that's all you got to do good is for you. You don't listen to the people you. don't listen knew, to the haters he knew how great you, you, you're you gonna be that's why <laughs> it's just funny because you what's can't his name <laughs> i can't you're nice he's he's a he's a yeah a white guy i'll say that <laughs> Yo, and also fuck what i would also guy. say if you guys have <laughs> hbo <laughs> max and you want to like be that. a young comic watch hacks oh have you seen that show hacks yo that show oh, is yeah? awesome and hacks. Uh, hacks. uh hannah uh I can't, I, I, no, hannah. Hannah. no the, hannah the young Lance. comic that's in it oh. I, I did like two shows with her here in la she's oh. an la comic it's really good, and it's a show about an older comic and a young comic, huh. and the young comic gets hired to be a writer for the oh, older cool. comic. Oh, cool. Oh, I think I, I, I want to watch that. And it's such a good show, and it's so oh, great. and it's such a good commentary on oh. comedy and stand-up comedy and our the state of com- stand-up comedy. So, yeah, that would be definitely awesome. a great show to watch. Hacks. Ha- watch oh, yeah. Hacks. All right, you can follow me at Kiki Funny Mama, K-I-K-I, and uh, at Crazy Woke Asians. Uh, all the info shows are coming up, festivals, uh, www.crazywokeasians.com. My name's Kiki Young. Thank you for subscribe. Tell your friends about it. Like it, comment, share it. We I uh, thank you guys, uh, Eric and Danny, for being here. The motherfucking tech genius, Paul, right there. Thank you so yeah, much. Paul. Yay! Paul. We're out. Happy endings. <laughs> Later, Happy <guys>. endings. <laughs>